Something kept coming to mind and then it was removing and I was noticing a particular, um, I guess you'd call it problem, but just a, a certain pattern, you know, that I have. And um, I don't think I was expecting that. I thought, oh, this is just going to be relaxing. But I really was, uh, really saw that pattern very strongly and was watching the distortion of it. And, and then I felt a little bit of settling down and clearing, but that kind of kept kept coming up for me. And I just, um, I could almost, uh, I was trying to picture like a straightening of that because I could see how there was a certain pattern distortion in the way that I, I tend to see life. And that's definitely not it being in the present. It, it has something to do maybe with a trauma or something. And, uh, and so I was just noticing the processing of this yeah. going on and on. And um, it was very helpful. And finally, I sort of settled down and yeah, really sort of felt very centered. Yeah, amazing. Very good. Very good. And just one more little step is to recognize that I noticed a, a pattern. You know, you noticed a pattern, you were working on a pattern. You say, you know, I have this pattern. You know, that that's, of course, you know, without doubt you know that it, it was here you experienced it you you feel you have it but you are not the pattern yeah you're not the pattern and you're 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 not the one who is subject to that pattern either and that's where now i want you to pay closer attention that the one who is subject to a pattern, it's the intermediary self, which is okay. And just beyond that, there is the pure self, which noticed the intermediary self experiencing the pattern, you know, processing the pattern. So I want you to recognize that. You know, while you did everything perfect at this step, but just to clarify to yourself that you're not even that self who was sub who is subject to the pattern. To recognize that, okay, I I have the pattern. It's okay to have a pattern, but I'm not only the one who has the pattern. So, so it's good not to assume that I am only that one who has a pattern. Yeah, so I'm not only that one who has a pattern, who has been working on it. I'm not only that one. And that can be very liberating. Yeah, because remember, as, as I said, there are these circling effects. And of course, it, it, it is, you know, de-patterning, which is a deep thing to do. But your an even greater liberation is to recognize that I'm not even the one who is de-patterning, who is purifying. While purification will always happen and continue, on a relative scale, you know, it's, it's something that will always go on as a, as a purification and that you realize, but to be more liberated is to realize that I'm not only the one who is getting purified. As, as Ramana would say, you are that pure, pure self who is already pure, the I, I, so to speak, the, the self. And then within the, the self, there is the more individual self who is purifying, evolving, growing, and it's okay to purify, evolve, grow, but even greater liberation is to recognize that I'm not only 
the, that one who is getting purified, evolving and growing. Yeah, not only that one. And, and how, how do you feel about that? <laughs> I think that's the missing step. I do tend to focus on the, um, the things to be cleared up because mm -hmm. yeah. I see them manifesting in my life, you know, and so those are the more obvious things. Yeah, so you get rewarded by <laughs> when they get purified, you, you obviously notice the benefits. <laughs> you know, the, okay, this has cleared, now I'm more free. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but but that there is a that another step <laughs> that I'm not only that one who gets purified mm -hmm. and sees the benefit of something I've cleared, <laughs> mm -hmm. and perhaps I'm that one which is already free. <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm. I guess it's like the saying, you know, you can't see the forest for the trees or whatever, but like the trees are in my. Uh -huh. you know, like, uh -huh. <laughs> okay i'll keep that in mind <laughs> yes 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 it's already in yourself <laughs> yes. okay thank you good, good and this is for everyone because you know there are many of you who are at this you know deep state and this advanced state and many of you are diligently working on purification, on, on de-patterning, deconditioning. And that's why this is so, so important to hear that you're not only that one, which is becoming more purified and beautiful and matured and experienced. Yeah, so give yourself an opportunity to recognize that at even deeper level, you might be already perfect. And then, yes, the personality is, is growing. You're getting older and wiser, <laughs> all of you, so to speak. Yeah, so, so personality is growing. You're getting more experience. And you're learning more and, you know, you're evolving and becoming more deconditioned. That, that's good. This is your evolution, yeah, which, which is important uh, to have focus on it. And this is, we could say, the right uh, way, the right way or the right uh, way of being. And even deeper than that, beyond that, is yourself who is witnessing your other self being purified and evolving and growing. Yeah, because then you say, oh, I noticed the changes. So maybe you are that self who notices your evolution. Uh, and that is even more liberating. Yes, very good, very good. This is like the, the, some of the deepest stuff that, that uh, people need to hear at the highest LOCs and the highest levels of consciousness. <laughs> 